The Duke Blue Devils flying high after back-to-back -back wins. They welcome in the Louisville Cardinals here in Durham. These two head coaches, both national champions as players. They're both in their first year. Bring him down a little bit because he's home to calm their emotions. There's the slam by Love. They love that play. Going to Lively. Duke is 13 for 26 from three. They're going to go downstairs for the slam. Filipowski rising up. All of his guys are on board with his level of enthusiasm playing at Cameron Indoor. Coach stepping in the lane. Mitchell with the finish. For this team to be successful. So to that point, every single time as Lively gets a dunk inside. You don't see that often in college basketball. Proctor lines up a long one. And down it goes. And he's so popular in Louisville. Has a huge party during the Derby. And again, he's well known for his attributes of the off the floor as Duke. And Grandison knocked down the three. Proctor will set it up. Young sets a screen. They move the ball well for Grandison again. And he's wide open to stick the triple. He does not get the credit that it deserves for how good quality basketball teams are. Well, that NC State team, they ran by them yesterday. It's a really good basketball team. That backcourt is dazzling. Here's Proctor, way downtown. Not even, they are. not even close, OB. That is a great team. There's a moniker that the ACC does not have in new teams. Virginia. 6-17 to go. Whitehead has been outstanding the last few games. Young will finish that one as he sticks it back up and in. To be able to keep them in play, everybody wants the emphatic block that goes out of bounds. Beautifully done there by Whitehead. That turns into a dunk by Mitchell. But that was Derek Whitehead going into the stands. When you see your teammates going after the loose ball, going into the stands to save it, it means you have to finish on the other end of the floor. Mark Mitchell, Kentucky with Adolf Rupp, was the first team to ever win a national championship with five blocks down. Pretty good movie about that, too. Yeah, it was. Well show to the top for Mitchell and a stuff. On their play. Tyrese Proctor with a hit ahead pass, just like Fonz and Seth talked about. Jeremy Rhodes finding Mark Mitchell, everyone touching the basketball, sharing the ball. John Team here for Whitehead up top. Can't drain it. Lively keeps it alive. Back out for a second effort. Off the iron again. And Mitchell goes up and he's got an add one. Boy, he's working hard in that lane. Struggle on the road, but to be where they are right now against the uh oh. <laughs> Final seconds of the half. Roach lifting. And down it goes. Very calm, cool, and collected. And that's the end of the half. And Trey, that's one of the things that Kenny Payne talked to us about earlier today was not settling for jump shots. And it's continuing to stay in attack mode. They've got a brace for a Duke run. It sounds like you've done a game or two here before. As have you, my friend. And way downtown, Filipowski fills it up. And they have their biggest lead tonight. Come out of that halftime locker room with a little bit more edge. Scooped up by Mitchell. Proctor lays it up. And tipped up and in by Filipowski. A little previous two minutes. Oh, what a move by Filipowski! And slams it down. Goodness. He's not trying to swat this 14 rows in. He's trying to keep possession of it. Filipowski with a sensational move. Exclusion. A lot of us couldn't do things. I mean, our joke is we couldn't even we couldn't even get a haircut. Well, listen, CB, for me as a black woman that played this game and for so many that watched you and that play this game now, we just have to say thank you so much. All right, well, thank you. Though so he talked to us about just winning small moments. It doesn't necessarily always it was not always going to result in winning a game as the second chance opportunity for Grandison is good. Louisville has hung around. Last possession opportunity to get it to one. The back door. Nice play. Out of timeout. Lively coming up for screen. Here's Proctor from three-point land. Loads to drive it. Skips into the paint. And it's going to fall for him. Six seconds on the shot clock. He's still having trouble. Bounces in here for Roach. He'll back it in once again. Just a coach at Kentucky who's used to winning. And we we'll talked to him about some of the people that he leans on and he talks to during these tough times. Of course, the first name he mentions is Larry Brown. Down the pay. Roach with the left hand. 
Duke running a little bit of clock here. 2.22 to go. Mitchell making his move. Using that window beautifully. And Duke about to salt this one away, leading 76 to 62 over Louisville. And for John Shire, this is no small thing. And nothing but net by Proctor. 20th of the season, 20 for John Shire in year one. Now 20 and 8 and 11 and 6 in the ACC.